What's up guys, it's Augie back to you here at Parts Online Network with your Tech Tip Tuesday. So today's tip is going to be how to remove the plastic uh, clear cover that covers the, um, the light inside the SRT10 RAM center console. Now, all of them are the same except for the quad cab with a sunroof option as in because of the sunroof they had to make the uh, upper set the upper console smaller so I'm gonna take you inside right now inside the truck and show you my foolproof method method on getting it out because a lot of people break these and we sell a lot of them so I'm gonna show you how not to break the tabs because they're very sensitive and I'll show you a picture of some broken ones that we have here um, it is very simple but it's just a technique of going in and popping it out and I'll show you that right now. All right, back in the truck now. So here we have the center console. I gotta be careful because there's a, a lot of glass in here on the floor since this car was wrecked. Um, all right, so so this is the uh, the center console, the the upper console, and you see how it has this uh, plastic dome light that clicks out. Now there's only three. There's a there's a small plastic piece, uh, plastic piece that goes over here, and that's what stops it from coming up and stops it from going up and down. And then there's two little plastic tabs that grab on a piece of plastic. Here, oh, here goes the one that I already took out. If this focuses, you'll see. And focus. Anyway, so these are the tabs that have a tendency to break. Let me see if I can get it up here. Anyway, so these are the tabs that have the tendency to break because they're it's 15 year old plastic. So if you just try to go all willy nilly and pop it right out, you're gonna break these and then you can't put them back on and then you'll be on used uh, partsonlinenetwork.com trying to get a new one and we're gonna ship you some. But we're gonna try to help you so you don't have to. I know it's kind of counterproductive of us not trying to help you not sell you a part, weird. But anyway, so I'm gonna put the camera down aimed at it or maybe I could just hold it up. But uh, the only tools you're going to need are a little pick set. Just one, I, I have two here just cause I'm weird. So what you're going to do, there are two tabs right here that I already showed you that are the, the culprits that always break. Um, some people try, will try to put a piece of uh, a screwdriver or even a pick right up here to try to push this out from, from up top. You don't want to do that because that tab is about an eighth of an inch that way and you'll, you'll wind up breaking it off. So what you do is you put a pick right in here Jam it in there just a little bit because that's exactly where the uh, tabs are holding on. And you just, boop, there you go. Comes off. None of them are broken. And now you can snap this back on when you've changed your ball because the ball blew out or whatnot. Um, yeah, so it's literally that simple. And that is your tech tip for your Ram SRT10, how to remove this uh, light cover in the upper console. Um, if yours is broken and you need one, you can contact us here at usepartsonlinenetwork.com and we'll ship you out a set, probably this one, because this is just gonna go into our inventory box. So do me a favor, let me know what other random tips you guys want to see in the comments of this video so we have an idea of what to make, even though we, we, we have a general idea of what videos we wanna do, but we wanna make content for you. So you let us know what you want to see, whether if that's removing the uh, the steering wheel, removing the glove box, something that you want to do to your car, but you haven't seen a video on yet, and you just want to make sure that we learn, or and we already know how to do them, but we break it, or so you don't have to. Um, but yeah, definitely let us know, um, and talk to you guys later, and uh, hopefully this uh, helps somebody out without breaking these. And again, if you need one, parts on, use partsonlinenetwork.com. And this is Augie signing out, so whoa. All right, real quick, I know that video is done, but I'm never finished. I, I told you guys earlier in the truck that I wanted to show you the broken one and where the tabs break. So I have the broken one here next to the, uh, next to the good ones, and I'm just gonna give you a quick preview of those. So if you see, these are the good ones. It's hard to focus, it's such a small item. Those are good, they're not broken. This side is good. But if you see, that one's broken. So if you do that to both sides, you're not gonna be able to get this back in. And then, like I said, you're gonna have to hit us up at usepartsonlinenetwork.com, which we don't mind, but we just wanted to give you this helpful tip so you don't have to break your center. All these are all good.
This one's the only one that was broken. I didn't do it, so it hasn't it hasn't messed up my 100% success rate. Uh, it's probably Andy, but don't don't let don't tell him I told you that. Um, or maybe somebody else. Who knows? But uh, I'm out.